come okay, baby, me how you do Sorry, you oh, fine, come, I'm singing this for you Does your husband take your meat? <laughs> oh, yeah. Tear them down into pieces <laughs> What you think that this be? <laughs> Ghana MTO, where are you? I say I'm bad Four hundred thousand. They charge six hundred thousand. One day they'll try to their children. This is where you were conceived. <laughs> <laughs> Sunday is the first Sunday of 2024 so we're on our way to church Rose is already outside so I forgot to bring a white skirt I thought I did so I'm doing a yellow skirt because you know Ghanaians they were all white on the first Sunday and 31st so let's go hopefully I get some clips of church we're going to Atomic I love this church so excited to go there so see you there hope you enjoy your Sunday as well Bye. This is the living room. Not what I expected, honestly. Mm -hmm. So, do we go in here mm -hmm. or here? No. This here? Okay. So, right now it's Cote d'Ivoire. Cote d'Ivoire is not doing a good job. Hopefully, Ghana does better. But it here's the so, menu. It says Sunday's only. My ginger drink is so good. Then you took out. I read it. Then you took out tiger nut juice a tiger drink it's so good i'm gonna get one when we're going home oh yay oh, our food is thank here. you <laughs> we're so we're hungry, hungry. Like, thank you so much Benku's for need to thank you Ooh, look so at good. the bowl know. wonderful wow. Ooh, thank you hey, yeah when it's rice soup. soup. So I was craving groundnut soup, but yeah, they got my order wrong, so they're coming back. Food has arrived. Wow, you can't tell me this isn't good. Mine took a while, so I helped Anita with the banku, and it was delicious. Delicious. Now it's time to try mine. Do you see this? Wow, look at the sizzle. It's hot. <laughs> Good morning. It's currently 5 a.m. We got up early this morning because we have to go to the village to visit my grandma. I wasn't actually supposed to go see her today. I was supposed to go see her tomorrow, but I had to bring up my trip because I was told that she's in the hospital. So we're going to go take a visit to the hospital because she has not been discharged yet. And we're gonna go visit her over there but like i said this is the first time i'm going to go and see my grandma without seeing my grandpa so i'm excited to introduce roland to her 
and I'm excited for that visit. So we're just currently waiting for our ride to arrive so that we can head over. In your local house. This is online house. Hi. Hi. Yo. This is Drapa Store. This is the a place called Kodiabe. It is about a 30 minute drive. This is awesome. The village where my grandma and grandpa come from. How are you? I'm not you're sweating, yeah? I know, I know. <laughs> I'm sweating. I'm sweating. I'm sweating. Yeah. Or knee, knee. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Ganobi. In the dangwe, in the oga. Hello, tree. Grab it. Yeah, I know what you put me on a beginning. Hi, vlog. So we're back from visiting grandma. It was such a nice visit. And then we found some nice bomb watches that someone's killing here <laughs> from what's it called? Um, Medina Wache. Medina Wache. Medina Wache. Apparently, it's good. There was a line, so that's how you know it's good. Here is my watch here. We're going to eat and enjoy. Bro has started already. So yeah, we're so hungry. So we're going to eat our watch. Hopefully you have something good to eat as well. <laughs> bon appetit. Bon appetit. How the fish? Good one. Oh, they gave big fish. Mm -hmm. Daniels love using spoons. Oh. Mm. Right? Oh. Uncle Ayosa shouldn't be I just said I didn't want the big meat I he took had. The meat, that's why. <laughs> that was the first thing. That... <laughs> this is my meat. <laughs> Does your husband take your meat? <laughs> oh, it's a thing. Yeah. Bad. yeah. <laughs> but I took your meat. <laughs> oh, we're taking my meat. Oh, I mean. oh, boy, boy, I know. Always be at. Always. Always. Always to get my meat. <laughs> Call it on camera. Let me just open one. I love. You don't even get the meat. But then in my mind, I'm like, ah, but I saw her yeah. put it on. Mm. So yeah, let me do what we need. <laughs> guys so we finished our bomb watch it took naps and now we're going to look at some investment properties in the cantonment area so we're going to show you what cantonment is working with just in case you want to invest so let's go look at some properties <laughs> This is um, a three bedroom duplex in Cantonment. It's called Adinkra Heights. This is the balcony. This one's fully furnished. It's very, very nice. The dining area is nice. And this is the kitchen area. The Oh, like an office space. This is all the first level. And then a bathroom again. And a shower. And then here's a washer and dryer. Usually in Ghana, the washer and dryer is like a two-in-one. 
Now let's go upstairs. One's high ceiling. It's nice. Oh, it's spacious. It is spacious. This is a master. Oh, it's very spacious. It's wow. really spacious. I like the space. This is a master washroom. Oh, then there's a what? Four bed, four bathrooms here. No, uh, two bathrooms. Two. Because there's two bathrooms downstairs. Oh, one, two, three. Yeah, there, yeah, three bathrooms. Yeah. So that's the so, second bedroom over there, and then. So he said these two bedrooms uh -huh. share. Share or a bathroom. The bathroom here. That's not bad. Yeah. The bathrooms are a good size. They're not bad. Oh, the bedrooms are huge. It's huge. It's huge. Oh my goodness. It's even bigger than the bedrooms in Canada. Oh, 1,000%. Nice. Yeah. The third bedroom is this size too? Yeah. And this is yeah, the third say. bedroom. <laughs> the third bedroom's the smallest one, but still very spacious. Nice, nice, nice. And this is what a three bedroom apartment in Cantonment looks like. Look at the view from the third bedroom. This is really nice. Well, you can just see their other apartment, but that's the rooftop over there. It's a beautiful place. I'll, I'll oh, you can, you can take it? it? Okay. Okay, so we just left the what is it? Consultation open house. <laughs> Did you guys see those prices uh, for a place in Cantonments? This is yeah. more than it's some not, places in US. No, yeah. That's crazy. It's not. It's not good. <laughs> it's not. Yeah. No, it's, not it's just. It. A, I don't know if it's the location because it's Cantonments, but. It's not nice to the extent where they're charging almost 400,000. No. Oh, 400,000? They're charging 600,000. Really? What? Almost 500,000. What are you talking about? Oh, okay. Yeah. So, no. That's a now. No, that's a no, no. A pharmacy. There's going to be a car rental shop, a gift shop as well. Okay. Open to the public. All of this open to the public as well. A glass pool at the top. Mm. We have an open air cinema. A conference in yeah, a basketball court, also some of the tennis courts. Wow. 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 So you might be asked, what style of units are you interested in? Okay. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. And as everybody's going to be new right at the time, we still have units available. Right. Right. Even though this is the hallways, you can see the difference from the oh, other well, place. So we're going to look at a one bedroom because a one bedroom's showroom is all that's available right now. Mind you, they're still doing construction on the place. I'm not sure. Yeah, that's fine. I mean, it's a one bedroom. Check this out. This is the one bedroom. Here's the one bedroom kitchen area. This is really beautiful. I like the furnishing. This is the living room area. Here's the bedroom. Closet space. Okay, nice. Would you say, um, okay, would you say this is this in because Ubuntu is one bedroom too, right? Mm hmm. Oh, the bathroom is very nice. The bathroom is very, very nice. Very modern. You can control all of them from here. So you can turn the bathroom lights off. Oh, uh, You can turn the chandelier off. Oh, wow. Okay. But there are manual switches also. So you can put the cat C lights off and keep. Um, and keep the chandelier on. Okay. Nice, nice. Oh, wow, nice. everything's controlled by the system. And then very modern. Um, you can set scenarios also. 
for the AC and the lights. Mm. And if you're not home and you want the lights on at a certain time and so on, you can call the front desk from here. Also. Right. And they can, okay. You can call the front desk from here? Yeah, but it's not configured just yet. Ah, uh, okay, it's okay. Oh, that's amazing. Here. And so, you can connect it to your phone. Right. Uh, so if you're out, you can put the lights on or put the AC on. This is a balcony space. I think this is the first floor, right? Yeah. This is really nice. I did not expect this. I would love to have seen like what the two bedroom or the penthouse would look like. Cause, yeah, yeah, yeah. Very modern concept. But yeah, this is Diamond in the City, one bedroom apartment. So this is the rooftop for Diamond in the City. Oh, they have like a game room. Cool area. These are so nice. What a nice rooftop. They have like a table. Yeah, this is so nice. I really like the concept for Diamond in the City. If you guys have heard of Pearl in the City, it's the same builders. So they have a couple of phases that are complete. So we're looking at the phase three, I believe. But the roof is really nice. I have never gone to a rooftop and seen um, antique cars on display. So, oh, this is nice. Look at the sunset. It's beautiful. And look at the tennis court and the gym areas also up here. When this place is done, it's gonna be beautiful. As you can see, all the construction going on down here. This is nice though. Wow. Park apartment. Yeah, very similar. This one is not furnished. When you purchase, you furnish yourself. One bedroom deluxe. Kitchen. The only thing I don't like. Oh, it has a step. Okay. The bedroom is actually pretty big for the deluxe. Oh, okay. Oh, the bedroom is actually really nice. Large. So deluxe like this? Yeah, reset. Here's the swimming pool on the, I guess this is on what, the first floor? Uh, second. Second floor. Evening, so we are going for a night out at Zen Garden. There's a live band, so Zen Gardens is usually really nice. It's like 10 o'clock, so hopefully we get somewhere to sit. If we don't get somewhere to sit, then we'll probably go to Purple Pub, because Purple Pub is always a vibe any day of the week. So let's go to Zen Garden and see if we are able to find somewhere to sit. Oh guys, we went to Zen Gardens. The music was so good. Live band was so good. Can you believe they ended at 11 because there wasn't a lot of crowd there. It's interesting what Ghana turns into when everybody's gone. So we've come, we've changed ourselves, and we're going to go to the beach. Yeah, we're going to the beach. You feel me? <laughs> what time is it? It's about... What does it say? 11.30? 11.30. 11.30, going to the beach. We're going to the beach. Watch, the beach will be vibes. Hopefully. Watch. Always that one person that will always have your heart. You never see it coming because you're blinded from the start. Know that you're that one for me. It's clear for everyone to see. Oh, baby. You gotta rock and wait in this one.
know about y'all, but I know about us. Yeah. It's the only way we know how to rock. I don't know about y'all, but I know about you. Oh, thank God we got the moon So this morning I am going to Jamestown Cafe, coffee shop. It's Ali Bar in the night, but um, Jamestown in the day. So I have my little two piece from Shein on and we're gonna go get some work done because I got a lot of editing to do because I promised you guys content. 
so I have to edit so I'm gonna go to the coffee shop to do some editing hopefully they have I believe they should have free Wi-Fi and then work for a good two three hours then come home and then um, continue our day so this is our fit these are the glasses for the look um, let me see if I can show you well yeah, this is the outfit and I put this on top very nice and light so let's book our car and we go do some editing We're walking to Oxford Street. It's about a 20 minute walk, but it's a nice breeze, so we can do it. I'm gonna put my phone away because the people on the motorbikes, when you're holding your phone, they like to come and just snatch your phone and keep going on their motos. I'll see you when we get to Oxford Street and we find the coconut guy. Chief Executive Office, GIS Board Office of Strategy. <laughs> Hey, you came up with the tutorial on how to open the door. This is Ghana International School History. This is a chairman, personnel, the history of the school. It first opened in 1955. And there is the big boss right there, Dr. Miss Mary Shaw from 2016 to 2023. Love it. I'm so proud of her. So nice. We're at my auntie's office. This is so, it's huge. You can build a home in here. These are our roads. Mm. Huh. It's a whole sunny. We contracted out, but chopped the money. Huh. Uh, and then uh, nothing gets done. Now they probably removed that thing already. Right there. That's not there. Mm -hmm. So there. I saw one there. I saw it. Yeah, look at it. So uh, there. Yes, this one. Yeah. Government of Ghana client, Ministry of Roads and Highways. Oh, this thing. Yeah. Uh, it's been the contract. Yeah. The contractor's yeah. name. What? Konongo Ashanti. Yeah, Ashanti, yeah. The contract's been given already. Wow. Long time. Yeah. Fix the road. Yeah? And then the person. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We are such a mild people and Kasafi we were going to look for this person in Konongo and ask him why. Why? Hmm. This is the other one. Yeah, this is the other one. And this is the first it goes and so one of these is we have to try it and see what it actually is. Hello, good morning. We started our morning early today. We're at Auntie's Cottage. Let me show you how beautiful this place is and this view is. It's such a nice getaway from the city. Let me just show you, it's so breathtaking. Hey, Henry, there's a thing on your leg. What? <laughs> You're so bad. <laughs> so annoying. <laughs> this is amazing. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Where are you running to? Yes, that tree is looking wow. so gorgeous, eh? Mm. What we could do underneath that tree. Oh, there's a road here. This is the road? Yeah. Oh. And there's a road on the side as well. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it echoes. We can get some chairs out here. Ah, echo, echo, so echo. Dark. This would be a nice picture. You want a picture? Yeah, we're going to spend our day at the cottage.
the camera is not even doing it justice. Like the views here. Hey, when you see this band, we are to check it out. Of course, for memories. Where are we, bro? Every. No, we're at Mampong. <laughs> <laughs> Uncle, stop laughing at me. Oh, this is a container. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, don't tell me you know it's a container. Angry, really? I'm talking to the blog. Oh. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> so you can delete him from the blog. Yeah. Ah. Look, there's a lizard. <laughs> <laughs> I have to lock the door. Don't get it. Where's the lizard? Where's the lizard? Where's the lizard? Where's the wall gecko. <laughs> you will yes. survive. Look at the lizard. So, is, you know what gets me? The, the fastness. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's like a slither. Yeah. <laughs> So we've got that living room. I can do a lizard. I can't do the... Stop. Yeah. Stop doing that. I know you didn't catch it. Oh, yeah. Stop! <laughs> <laughs> Bro, stop! <laughs> so oh, this is... Wow. This is the hammock. So you see the... Oh, oh that you oh, put oh, out oh, there. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. And then we use that. Hey, look, this one is a sleep hole. This is so... For food, they're for food they're talking about. <laughs> This is so nice. Oh, our fridge stocked up. Oh, oh nice. nice. I think I need to Oh, I got more. the books. This is yeah. so peaceful. This is actually really no. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. oh, this, this is, is nice. nice. And then we've got our... Go, go. Auntie, do you see the millipedes inside the house? No, no millipedes haven't there. come. They're just little holes, so it's more for... Ah. Uh, and then yeah. there's a... They, do, the they do a great job, yeah. So you see the shower. Oh! You see? It's like a full out, yeah. Full Standing out. shower. So this, so is, this is a 40 foot container? Yes. Okay. Oh, wow. Mm. And this is a solar panel. Wow. This is our solar system. Mm. Um, this? So as soon as I came, I checked and we are low on electricity, 13%. So how do you... Um, oh, you just have to I, wait for the sun. Really? really? Yeah. That's the only There's yeah, nothing so, else. So that yeah. means yesterday there was no sun then? Yeah, so maybe it really rained. Or it rained because so the grass is a bit wet. Uh, yeah, it's, yeah. it's yeah. been yeah. raining. It so rains. when the sun isn't too strong. And then during Hamatan as well, the panels get dirty. Mm. So the guy says he's coming to clean it this week. So once the panels are, are clean, clean, then, then the, the sun can go in. in. Okay. Yeah. That makes sense. Yeah. Those are our booties for our village walks. Village walks. Uh, walking around the property. Oh, wow. So where did the guy clothes go? Do they like... The way that you were just chipped. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing will happen to you. <laughs> <laughs> no, so the closet, <laughs> everything gets, it's, it's all done. All this is part of the build. Oh. Right? oh. The wow. Yeah. This is nice. I know, this is actually really nice. This everything. is so nice and high. You here? Yeah. This is where you were conceived. Can you grab it for me with your long arm? Yeah, look. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Today is Friday. <clears throat> we are going on a road trip this morning, a two hour road trip. It's currently 6 a.m., 6.15 to be exact. We were trying to leave home at 5 a.m., but slept in. So 6 a.m., we're on the road. Hopefully we get there on time. We're going on a road trip to Akosomboa, Gomenya, to be exact, to visit um, some of my family. So join us for the ride. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, there's so many monkeys on the road. I think it's clear now. Look at them fighting on the road. Roll slow down. Roll it! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Yo! Look at some of the baby 
shirts back. That's so cute. Uh, good morning. <laughs> I'm so excited, but I'm stressed. We decided to take a private car. This car is stressed. It's already stopped on the Tamamoto way once. And it wouldn't turn on until he opened it and had to use a rock and press the inside. Ghana way. And it's just a known thing in Ghana. So I decided, let me just vlog and have you guys come along for the journey because it's going to be a long one. We have about 54 minutes left to get to the landmark we're trying to get to um i don't know i think we'll be on this road sad yeah, until we yeah, get yeah. there so right now we're on the, the tema road. on the tema road this is what the road is looking like hey it's coming kuma road road tema road oh sorry it's called how would i know <laughs> it's, it's Kwame and kuma road so yeah oh. Pray for us we will get there safely in jesus name ghana mto where are you this is how he's sitting. Do you know how high he's sitting on the highway? There's no space in the truck. Hmm. Look how big this, these potholes are. The camera is doing it justice. How bad this road is! But we'll be there soon. But it's, it's six kilometers of this. Six kilometers is twenty minutes. Can you imagine? Hmm. Just because of bad road. Bad road, yeah. The fact that Google knows the road is bad and accounts for that is interesting. So this area is called Ball. So you see how, usually for us, this is what the GPS says, you see how yellow or red means that there's usually traffic? In Ghana, this is what the orange means. The road is bad. Google knows the road is bad. So it shows you orange or yellow. Red is usually actual traffic, but that's amazing. Ghana has actually gone forward in terms of oh GPS. Shit. <laughs> I don't even think the camera is capturing it. Well. Hey, look, a whole. What is this? <laughs> this random stuff. Random stuff. <laughs> oh my goodness. It's so random. Like, why is this blocked? So random. Like, why? No idea. Manya Krobo Senior. Hey, Church of Pentecost is everywhere. Ball District. <laughs> We're supposed to go straight and they blocked the road. So, what are we to do? How are we supposed to know where to go? Road closed. That's another. Hopefully, it's not. 7 10. And there's a plaza. For the key plaza. Cool. That's how you know we're in a communal area. Koleki. That's me. Yeah, you ready? <laughs> hey, it looks really good though. Hi guys. So I took off my hair because I have to do it again. Um, it took me a while to take off, so I'm not going to be redoing it today. But we came to Auntie's house, and it's so awesome to be able to go to your Auntie's house and there always be food. Like, look at what we found Benku and Okro. Mine is warming. Let me, let me show you the lineup. My camera is not doing justice at all. There, now it is doing it justice. Let me show you what else we have pepper. <laughs> oh, 
Okay, we came at the perfect time. <laughs> Hi, I'm back. It's 4 p.m. I went to do my hair this morning at this lady's joint that I saw when I was walking by and I'm very, very, very glad I did because look at this, look at my hair. Look at the neatness. Like the image that I even showed her, she did better than that. And to make to make matters even better, she didn't overcharge me. And she was actually she's actually a Nigerian lady that has moved to Ghana. She's from Abuja. She's moved here because I guess business is better for her here than in Abuja. So she's here. So I went in, you know, in order for them to not rip you off, you have to go in speaking the little tree that you have. But as soon as I started speaking tree with her, she was like, oh, please, like, I'm not Ghanaian. I don't understand the language. You have to speak English. I was like, oh, perfect. Put my tree back in my pocket and spoke English with her. She washed my hair for me. She dried. She used her own hair. And this is a final look. I'll show you what I asked for. On um, It's tied up. I will show you it down. Like, I just, I'm hungry. I'm waiting for my food to arrive. So I'll, I'll show you when it's down, fully down, how nice it is. But I just did, like, a short shoulder-length hairstyle. But, like, she did better than I expected. This is giving Fulani. Wow. 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 I don't, wow. I don't think I've ever been this impressed with my hair before. The cornrows are so neat. Anyway, just take a second and guess how much she charged for this. Just take a second and guess. She charged me 130 Ghana CDs. Now that's about 11 USD, 15 Canadian. You see why I do my hair every week when I'm here? Do you see why? Because you won't get this anywhere. Look at this. Look at this. Take a good look. You won't get this anywhere. Whoo! I'm gonna go eat now. I hope you're having a good day. Bye. I am currently going to Duncan's Banku joint. If you know, you know. If you're ever in the Osu area and you like Banku and tilapia, me and Roland have already been there once, but today I'm going there with my girl Anita. So we're waiting for our ride to get here so that we can go. We've been craving. We starved all day so that we can enjoy this Banku and tilapia well. Well, well. So I'll let you know when we get there. But um, I just need a little beat because with this hair, I feel like if I don't put any makeup on, I look like an infant. So I had to do something small, but it's very cute. I don't think I've ever done short braids before since I was a child. And I'm wearing a tube top, like I'm, I'm dressed. And I'm glistening because I have mosquito repellent all over my skin. Whenever I'm going out in the evening, whenever you're going out in the evening, remember, mosquito repellent, mosquito repellent, mosquito repellent always. <laughs> The tilapia. They have 150 CDs, 170 CDs, and 200 CDs. That's the 200 CDs. You. I think that's what I got with Roland the other day. So I'm gonna get. We're gonna get the 170 this time.
this everything. I'm so happy. It's actually hitting every day. We have done it justice. Where is the tilapia? Where's Waldo? Where is the tilapia? All gone. Gone. All gone. We did well. We're at Republic now. Taste and see that the Lord is good. Blessed is the one who takes refuge in him. Psalm 34 verse 8.